Okay, good evening mga dear students, uh, GMP family, and for those who love to edit sounds, to sing, to perform, so I'm going to show you uh, an audio application we used. Usually this is very good for beginners. Sa mga gusto magsimula, uh, we call this the Adobe Audition software. So here I'm going to show you how to edit vocals, kung paano magtunog chipmunks, uh, paano magtunog monsters, no? you can use for your projects. Uh, so first of all, we are using Adobe Audition. This is uh, built, which is 12.1.3.10. Uh, okay. So actually, uh, I'm an Apple user. I, I'm, uh, I use uh, GarageBand and Logic Pro software. But for beginners, we can use this uh, Adobe Audition. There are special features of this uh, DAO or Digital Audio Workstation na at least you can, you can explore like we have to how to generate audio how to generate tones no i'm going to show you different uh ways on how to record and edit sounds so the first thing we have to do is we're going to record a sound using my behringer c1 microphone so this is a, a very affordable condenser microphone i bought from behringer store so, napakatibay niya. Kahit iba to mo, hindi siya masasira agad. <laughs> this one. Yan. C1. But I also have Kiwi microphone. But for for studio use, for uh, studies and editing, and for practice, for rehearsal, I use this condenser microphone. So, hello, hello. So, you have to set first your output and input to... The interface I'm using, I'm using M Audio interface. Okay, so you have to check the Adobe settings. So click Audio har Hardware, and then default input you can see M Track two by two M, and default output to M Track uh, two by two M also. So you can click OK. So and then. We can try recording some sounds. No, let's try. You can click this one. So this is in the middle. This is what we call the timeline in Adobe Audition. It consists of different columns. So here in column one, you can see and you can get all the sounds you want to edit or record. And in the middle part, you can see the effects rack where you can use uh, different effects or what we call signal processors. So here we have around 15. But we'll just use the basic ones. So, uh, let's try to edit the sound. I'm going to sing. Let's try this one. Okay. Yeah, and let's record. Uh, I'm going to sing hello, my test. Ha 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 ha. Ha ha. I'll sing the my one of my favorite songs. When you're weary and feeling small. When tears are in your eyes, I will dry them all. Okay, that's all. Hello, thank you. <laughs> so let's uh, play. St stop. There. Let's play it. How does it sound? Ha 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 yeah. And feeling small. You can use uh, this one when to zoom in horizontally and vertically. Okay, that's all. Hello, thank you. 
So let's place. Okay, so we started in this part here. When you so we can cut this part. So you just click delete. There. When you're weak and feeling small, when tears are in your eyes, I will dry them all. Okay, that's all. Hello, thank you. Mm -hmm. So let's place these. Okay. So we can put some effects in it here. So if you're going to click the effects track, there are uh, a lot of effects you can see. We have amplitude and compression, the delay and echo, the filter and EQ, the modulation, the noise reduction, the reverb. We also have special effects, stereo e imagery, and the times and pitch. So for if you like to change the pitch, Pitch is the the range of the voice. So you can change or transpose the pitch. If you're going to transpose it to Ted, it will sound like this. <laughs> Sounds cute. Hello, thank you. <laughs> yeah. So you can you can change it. You can change the pitch. So that's just chip on sound. I'm feeling We can also use some noise reduction. Because my door is open, so maraming sumasamang hindi importante. Especially the, the one I recorded is a stereo. So we have left and right track. I, I, my vocals is in the right track. The noise reduction. Can we check it? Just little here. Hello, thank you. One, not to put uh, too much noise because you can. You, it will also delete your actual voice. And we can amplify it. Uh, amplify. Okay, yes. Hello, thank you. You can subscribe at my channel. So actually, I've been doing uh, uh, covers, which I use different voices. Okay, like this one. So I can use this. Yes. I'm feeling small when tears are in your eyes. I will dry them all. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. So here is the, that is the chipmunk. Uh, how to do a chipmunk effect using uh, Adobe Audition. So don't forget to like our page, the Grand Music Palace page. And if you have any questions regarding uh, softwares, what to use in Adobe Audition, or what what to use like uh, questions about GarageBand and Logic Pro, you can message me uh, at our channel. So thank you very much and happy Valentine's Day to all.